Okay, so here we have a, a cleft baby. Uh, you can see the cleft cutie is born with bilateral cleft lip and palate. Uh, we call it bilateral because as you can see, both the uh, sides, the lip is cut. And this is the left side, right side and the left side, which is cut. And the lip is come a little bit forward, the central part. That's because the muscles aren't around the lips. So the objective of our surgery that we're going to plan now is to get the muscles from this side and the muscles from this side going through and forming like how it's for us. Now, the important thing here is after we do the first surgery, the baby would have near normal lips in due course of time. And once we do the cleft palate, the baby will be also able to speak normally. Uh, so even though the defect looks quite big, uh, in not such a long time, uh, we are able to uh, fix the defect and kind of make these people normal. So you don't worry. Okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you. How long will the, surgery? the, well, the surgery and the recuperation? Uh, the surgery might take about uh, an hour and a half to two hours at most because we have to get the muscles dissected um, and also you have to be sure that there is very minimal scar mm -hmm. or no scar. Recuperation is usually very fast for babies, you know, like we let the babies feed after two hours. After two hours. Two hours, yeah, and they can even suck on the breast if they need to. Um, so we don't have to wait that long for the baby to recuperate. Um, the babies also, we try to use some glue and stitches, but very minimal stitches mm -hmm. these days. Um, but still, after five or six days, for a wide bilateral lip like this, you know, it's sometimes useful to go in and do some suture removal, cleaning of the glue. So we're left with very minimal scar when the child grows up. Mm -hmm.